Hey guys, and welcome back. And if you're new here, thanks for joining us today. <laughs> so we wanted to bring you along with us on a little nature drive. Mm -hmm. We're staying at the Winter Garden RV Resort, um, which is in Winter Garden, Florida. Mm -hmm. It's a trails collection. And it's, did you say 11 miles? 11 miles. 11 miles um, away from that park. There's this place, which is called? It's the Lake Apopka Wildlife Drive. Wildlife Drive. And we hope that you enjoy it. There's tons of gators and birds. And this is a water management um, land. Mm -hmm. Water management district. <laughs> it's free um, so that you can enjoy, I believe it's seven miles worth of driving I in here. So. And you can stop along and take pictures and do videos and just enjoy this beautiful scenery. So come along with us. And there's a birdie Ooh. trail. Yeah, they even have a little bike route. You're off to the right side. Hi there. Hi. How are you? Good. First time? Yes. Yep. So you are you're kind of in the middle of the road. If you scoot off to the left, I can fill you in. Okay. Oh. Awesome. Is that good? Where about you from? Oh, I'm from Florida. Miami. Fort Lauderdale. <laughs> Fort Lauderdale. Yeah, I live down in... Uh, Miramar for 10 years. Oh, Miramar, Kendall yeah. Lakes for two years. Kendall Lakes? Not that far south. Where else? Miramar, I have family that lives in Miramar right now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So you've seen gators. Uh, yes, yeah, but I have. can't get enough of them. Neither can the 500 cars in front of you. They <laughs> won't take a picture of every gator. So when I tell you where that sign is, the, that's the white sign on the left, when I tell you that that becomes a one-way and it's 11 miles to make the drive, Okay. Your guess for how long it will take will be two to two and a half hours. Oh my gosh. Because everybody wants to take pictures of those gators. Of so course. whoever's in front of me, I have to wait for them to do their thing. Because the road's going to narrow to one lane. Okay. okay. Um, and you, do can you, walk, just, you, can, you can get out any place you want. Can you do this or you have to stay on the road the whole time? Prefer, like passing? Whatever, whatever works. Okay, so it's okay. Right. But the thing is, if you got seven cars behind you and... You've got room that they can kind of scoot by if you only moved over a foot and a half. Right. Why wouldn't you do it? Right, that's what I want. You will find out why you wouldn't do it. Okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> got it. So, and there's very limited porta potties. So, where that white sign on the left is, there's one porta potty. Okay. If you go two miles straight, you're going to come to the lake. There are probably four or five porta potties. And then there's a mist, mystery porter potty <laughs> yeah, somewhere mystery. down there that I'll let you find on your own. <laughs> and, uh, is this a loop? It brings me back it's out. A one, yeah, it's a one way. Okay. So it's going to go two miles that way and zigzag to your right. Uh -huh. And since you're from south, you probably don't know where, but where Zellwood, <laughs> Plymouth, and a pop is this orange blossom trail. Okay. It's going to dump you out there. Okay, okay. so it's just going to take me out. Yeah, it's just there. Okay. Uh, the best wildlife viewing is the first seven miles probably. Okay. Um, the gators should be coming out a little bit. I've got a fancy map. Okay. I'll take your fancy map. <laughs> but the nice thing about the fancy map is this is not a park. It's a water district. Okay. They're still getting rid of all the pollutants from the last 40 years. So this whole thing is closed off to everything but bicycles and walking. Okay. So you can't even drive it. So now this confusing map is not so confusing. Okay. <laughs> But Glenn says, that's my name, when in doubt, <laughs> go straight. When in doubt, go straight. Go straight. That's a little and difficult yeah, for me, but well, okay. That's, <laughs> I, uh, that, that might be a challenge. I, I, that's, that's a good lead into another challenge. <laughs> that's another challenge. I'll go down, down, down. Okay. All whatever right. Floats, I had whatever, to, though. Whatever floats your I had to because it was just too good <laughs> to pass up. But enjoy yourself. Cars okay. passing you by. Okie okay, right. dokie. Thank you. You have a good day. Thank you. Happy New Year. <laughs> when in doubt, when go in doubt go no. <laughs> I couldn't pass that up. All right, guys, let's go for this little drive together and see what we see. It looks like it's very popular. Yeah. There's a lot of cars. Where the white sign was, he said this was the first port of potty. Oh, There's an audio one. Oh, I'm good. We're going to learn about the lands. What we want to see is some wildlife. That's so pretty. It is very pretty. My goodness. All these like little views 
growing out Look of the Look at the, the duckies water. inside. Those are the ducks with the... Oh, with the little red head. With the red head. I forgot the name of them. The red beak. There's a bunch over there, too. <clears throat> my seatbelt so that I can be able to maneuver myself around a little bit more comfortably. That is so pretty. Wish I would have stopped. That's a great picture. Baby, you can stop whenever you want, my love. Oh, that's right. He did say I could stop. You can now. stop whenever you want to take your pictures. Alright. I'm stopping. Is that a bird all the way over there? Um, maybe. <laughs> See it all the way over there? Over there? It's hard the white, for me big, to see. big bird. Big, the big patch of green in the center. Uh huh. Look at the big patch right here. Uh huh. You see, look at the bird. Yeah, I see a. Oh, it's not there anymore. Okay, I'm like, I see a normal sized bird. Yeah, right there. There's a bit, no, right there. White. Oh, in the middle. Yeah. I thought that was like grass. Wow, mm. that is big. Yeah, that is a bird. That's the one I was trying to take a picture of. It's very rocky, but totally worth it. It's a good thing I'm holding, what is this thing called? The gimbal. gimbal. <laughs> if not, I don't think they would enjoy it being rocky. That's so pretty. <laughs> little birds croaking. Oh, there's a whole bunch of little birds floating around there in the pond. Play the lady pulled over to take pictures of the mom. Well, not palms, like a popka. I'll let you know when I spot a gator, baby, so you can get some pictures. Mm hmm. Man, it's driving me crazy the name of that bird. <laughs> and it ended with hen. It oh, was something, shoot. Something hen, remember? Yeah, that's right, because we're like what yeah that's right and we saw it i think it was like mineola yeah. there... no i think we saw it at the preserve and <clears> when <throat> we were in winter garden also. one of those nature walks we did yeah oakland park oakland park preserve i think that's what it's called people trying to get around but the doors are open i love the attendant <laughs> glenn mm -hmm. There's a white bird right here. Right, see him straight oh, ahead, yeah. mommy? I like it. Get a lot. Mm -hmm. Let me move a little bit over here. Oh no, I went zoomed out. Let's go so in. I'm not sure what that is. And I left my glasses in Boga, so I can't put them on to see better. But anytime we see something, you know, some birds, some nice scenery, some gators, we're going to be pulling over so that Lou oh. can do some pictures. You may know from previous vlogs, us being digital nomads, living full time on the road, Lou's main source of income is her photography. She comes out, takes pictures, and it brings me joy seeing her sitting at the computer fixing her pictures up and then the part she doesn't really enjoy is uploading it to different websites to uh, sell them. And then me, well, I just do technical support for Vivian Home Security. But it's nice coming out and checking out nature and architecture and all kinds of things so that she can get her photography in. <laughs> Oh, I'm still I zoomed couldn't in. take a picture of it. Oh, no. No, it's grooming. There's a gator right there. That's why these people were pulled oh, over. Yeah, baby. <laughs> All right. This is it for you guys. Let's see. Let's see if I can zoom four times. Oh, 
let's see if there's another 10 times. Does 11 even in 10? No. Or is my not? I just mentioned so Yeah, there's, there's a one gator right there. There's one on this and side. And there's one over there, look. One on that side. Over here, look. Look here. So we were trying to oh, live I there. The... And then there's one there. Oh, I saw it's the food. The lava. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. What'd you see? <laughs> the Chinese lady behind <laughs> got all excited when she saw the thing. She was like, what'd you see? <laughs> look. Oh, these gators are huge! Oh my god, his mouth! <laughs> um, the pictures probably aren't going to be like really great. We'll see what you can do with them because of all those branches that are hiding them. There's a lot more gators. We'll see. Yeah, we're going to see a lot more. I did tell our viewers, so I'm going to tell you so that I can hold you to it, that if you have some of these pictures fixed by the time it's time to upload this video, we'll do a little beaver with some of your photography. Um, okay. <laughs> But she need to find something. Yeah, but if she didn't move to the hands. side enough. They're so pretty. With their little white beaks and oh, like a little bird. crown. Oh. That bird is everything. That bird is everything. You see it? The black one? Uh, yeah, it looks like, is it like one of those snake birds? Look how my glasses so And then a ginga. A ginga. I'm so upset that I left my glasses behind. He said that they have a bicycle trail. So yeah. That could be a... If there's an area to just leave the car and park, this would be awesome coming on the bike. No, but not this area. On the other side, he says that there's a bike path. Yeah, check it out. Mm -hmm. It looks like lush grass, but it's... <laughs> it's, it's not floating. lush grass, it's just like... These little, I don't know, leaves growing out of the water. Look, there's a bird right there. See it? Yeah, the here on the side of it. That does a road. Let's see if I can take a picture of it if it won't move. Look at this guy. Walking over the binoculars and camera. <laughs> I think if there's another pool out, we pull into it, park oh. for a little bit, and get off and walk around for a little bit. I'm down for that, baby. I love the sounds of all these birds. <laughs> They're cute with their white beak. I know. I guess everyone's pulling into there. Oh yeah, there's a little... Uh, there's a gator in there, but it's hard to see it. It's look, tucked in. there's yeah. a little oh, okay. thing over there that everyone's pulling into. You want me to do the same or do you want me to continue? Um, no, because it doesn't look like that's a parking spot, so don't worry about it. It looks like they're just standing there on the little pier looking out. Oh, I think you're forced to. I don't think this goes forward. Oh, okay, I see. Or does it? Yeah, it continues. It's just a no, loop you're around. forced to loop around, mommy. Yeah, it's a this loop. person just. But it continues. Yeah. It's just a loop around. 
That's not what I was asking. Oh, mommy, you're going to have to stop and get that bird oh, over there. Oh, my God. My love. Yeah. It's humongous. I know. I see it. I'm in love. Okay, this person's leaving, so I can pull over. I can park over there on the, the dry grass over there. Yeah. Mm. And on that note, let's come check out this tiny for sized alligator. Huge. with a drive after that little stop. There's another little one back there. Oh yeah, I see it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> naughty, naughty. <laughs> Coming up on something because we've got a pile of cars pulled over again. It's a nice flower bed to take pictures of. This is beautiful. Yeah, it's so beautiful. And then yeah, that's well, probably why they stopped to take a picture. Mm. Yep. There's actually two. There's one over here oh, and I the one over there. Over here is, that one's better. Two. The one over here is better. Let me get out. Would you kayak in these waters? I don't think so. <laughs> How about you guys? Tell me below in the comments. Would you kayak I don't think in it's these allowed. waters? Yeah, probably. Well, yeah, in Lake Apopka, you can. But not this section, But this no. section, yeah, I guess. Because he, he said that this was water history. management land. Yeah. <laughs> this is Department of Water Management. When he said that at the beginning, I was happy because I was like, oh, there's our ca is there a yeah. campground? I was like, can we camp here? Is there a campground so somewhere? Park RV? <laughs> when he had like the, the map open, he's like, on this side, I'm like, he's going to tell me. And, and he was like, no. 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 That side is closed. Oh, okay. <laughs> Completely the opposite. Oh, there was two gators in there too. I did notice it's hard now. We were so caught up with talking and there's a huge bird in there. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Those two gators were more hidden, though. You wouldn't have gotten. Oh, and this is now water on both sides. Before, it was just water on one side. Actually, I think it's been water on both sides, but more vegetation. Uh, I didn't bring see. my binoculars. I should have brought my binoculars. Okay, this is a little pullover. So that's bad. So let's do that. Okay. Oh, look, it's going to tell us about the birds.
Beautiful. It is gorgeous. We've got a gator straight ahead. But it looks like he's tucked himself in. It's the tail sticking out over there. Do you guys see it? Of course, we've got the trying to get a picture over there of it. <laughs> I got the gator too. You did? Uh huh. There seems to be a lot of different little areas. You can pull over to the side to walk around and get off and take pictures, even though obviously a lot of people pull over so that you can take your pictures. Um, Lou spotted, I think this is a great heron over here off to the side. So we're gonna go take a picture of it. We highly recommend if you're in the Orlando area, make it a point to come out Orlando, here. Orlando, Claremont, Orlando, Winter Claremont, Park Winter Garden, Kissimmee. I mean, it's all the general area. Mm -hmm. Definitely make the trip out here to see nature and see wildlife. Even if you're not like a photographer or anything of that sort, it's still beautiful to see and experience. And it's free. <laughs> yeah, it's. I think the guy at the beginning, Glenn, said that it was seven miles. Um, yeah. It's totally worth it. We're working our way over to a building. It's the oldest building of something or another. <laughs> so we're going to go figure that out and see what it is. <laughs> All right, there's a few trailheads. I mean, he did say that there was a bike trail. So I guess there's also a regular trailhead. It's free to hike as well. Let's go check this out. So at one point, right before you run into that house that we just, or that building <laughs> that we just ran into, there's a little bridge to go over. Um, so this whole one way or one road um, converts into this. So if we go, we can go. It's gotten blocked look. up right now, so there must be something photography worthy over there. This water management, management district. district area does Obviously, there's going to be wildlife here. There's going to be rabbits and bobcats and deer. It's just going to be a lot harder to see things like that. You're going to see a lot of gators and you're going to see a lot of birds. Um, I overheard somebody saying that there are over 300 species of birds on here. And, and I get it. I've seen so many different types. It's amazing. So, I mean, there's... Look at those two right there. Oh, my God. There is... 
Well, went straight ahead there. Amazing. And then this one, they both just flew in as I was talking to you guys. And they were enormous as they were flying in. If I'm not mistaken, I believe this white one here is a gray heron. And then that gray one out in the middle of the water is the blue heron. This is awesome. It's almost like driving to the Keys, having water on both sides. <laughs> oh, it's got a friend. Seems there is a tail of the gator right there, and Lou, being all brave, is going right over there and taking a close up picture of it. I mean, we're stopped, anyways. There's a pile up of cars. I can't believe it's that close to the road. Incredible. I wonder if she can see its face. I don't want to get out. Nope. No, Siri Bob, I will see it from the truck. And yet another gator right over there. You guys can see this huge gator straight ahead of me because he is huge and black and he's facing us. And he's just laying there. There's another one over there as well. Do you see the other one over there, baby? No, but I see a turtle over here. Do you see a turtle over here? Look, right here. Isn't that a turtle? Oh, no, it's a bird. Sorry. <laughs> the, the way it's hiding, the home. Yeah. What a great picture. I thought it was a turtle because you could just see like the little... Black. We've decided... Oh, look at that one. That one's sitting up. Back so that I can be the driver and Luke can enjoy being a passenger taking pictures. But look at this guy. Yeah. He's posing there. That's a great picture. Yeah. My love. You have to stop. My focusing. camera's not focusing. Yeah. Those cameras are already done. <laughs> so we are going to come back for Friday so that she can focus more on photography. This is incredible though. If you're going to show anything significant, otherwise it's just... I do have it on two times zoom. <laughs> <laughs> because I know the camera doesn't see it the way our eyes see it, so I definitely want our viewers to check out these gators out here. We'll see when I'm that editing getting, how it looks. That one's getting good sunbathing. Yeah, here. that one's totally sunbathing. No tucked into bushes. <laughs> that that one's a monster. Look at the head. Those are some brave birds right there. <laughs> you think they're teasing him? Kentucky Fried Chicken. It's really long. Mm -hmm. Mm 
I know it's a whole lot of the same, so I keep turning off the camera because on video, it's just not as fun watching the same thing over and over again. But if you come in person, I'm sure you can do this drive for an hour or two and just love it. There's a baby gator over there, my love. Oh, yeah. You see it? <laughs> um, so I don't want to do a lot of the same and make this video super long. But you guys can see the background and all the clips I've just shown. It's just, it's majestic. It's peaceful. It's beautiful. Yeah. And... Again. no it's fine and as lou has mentioned it's free <laughs> we would have totally paid five dollars ten dollars fifteen dollars to come through this drive um but yeah it's water management land and it's free to the public for you to come and enjoy mm -hmm. so do that come and enjoy it <laughs> he's not moving he's just laying in the water looks like he has his face tucked into the grass like, don't take a picture of me. <laughs> don't. Oh, there's another one in the water here as well. Sideways. What do you guys think about this guy? You're off to the side of the road, face facing the water and tail out against the grass. We hope you enjoyed this little drive in the Lake Apopka Wildlife Drive with us. If you did, please give us a big thumbs up. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you get notified every time we upload a video. And as always, thanks for watching and we'll see you soon. <laughs> get my air buddy here. Bye guys. <laughs> kind of feel like a gator could just come up here and like eat us. We can totally be gator food up here. Yeah. This is so close to the water. Before you walk away from me, I don't know if you guys can see a bunch of people are pulling over to take pictures. There's a ton of birds that have migrated and they're just hanging out up there. Do you guys see them? Look at them all up there.